Hey Stampers, welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey, part of the Stampin' Jill creative team, and today I'm excited to share with you a card layout that's super fun and pretty simple. For this card, I am using the Thoughtful Wishes Cling Stamp Set from the new annual catalog, as well as the Coordinating Designer Series paper that is so, so beautiful. This watercolored look paper is perfect for the kind of card I'm going to show you. So cute. Okay, let me show you the card. This is what it looks like. And then you can open it and have a cute little saying in here. Now, the one that I stamped here, I don't love it on this side because when you open it fully, I didn't realize that my little sentiment or my little design here was going to cover up my sentiment. So when I stamp this again, I'm going to stamp it over on this side. I'll show you what I mean. This really cute card is a such a great layout for a really simple card for you to make. Let me show you how to do it. So we're going to take our piece of six by six designer series paper, and I'm going to cut that down to two strips of five and a quarter by one and seven eighths. So I'm going to take this and this strip so that they're the two coordinating ones. So I'm first going to cut this down to five and a quarter, just like that. And then I'm going to cut this to one and seven eighths and then another to one and seven eighths. Just like that. So I have those two cute pieces of um, designer series paper that are like right next to each other. Okay. And then I'm going to come with my five and a half by eight and a half piece of cardstock. And I'm going to just fold that in half. And I'm just going to crease that down really well. And then I'm going to fold that right back, that top flap right back on top of itself, just like that. Crease that down really well. Super simple. And this is what our card base will look like. Okay. And then let's build our card. I'm going to use Stampin' Seal and adhere those two pieces right down to my card base with a cute little frame around it, just like that. So cute. And then we can decorate this up. I love using circle punches. I'm gonna use the two and three eighths inch circle punch for a piece of petunia pop. And the two inch circle punch, I'm gonna punch out a piece of basic white. And we'll do my stamping on this basic white piece. There's this really cute floral stamp. And I'm gonna stamp that on my two inch circle with Mossy Meadow, full strength. And then I'm going to stamp it off just like that. Kind of gives it a fun dynamic look on there. And then I'm going to use the Petunia Pop Blends. And I'm just gonna color in these flowers here. Just give it a little bit a blend look. And I don't want them to be too perfectly colored. I just kind of want that really imperfect colored look. I don't know how to explain it other than that. Just like that. And then we'll just adhere that down on our Petunia Pop circle. And we're going to use some dimensionals and pop that up. I'm gonna make sure that I only put the dimensionals on this side of my circle and center that on my card. And then I have a strip here and we'll stamp dearest friend just in the center and trim some banners into each side. And we'll adhere that down just right here underneath. 
taking care again to only do it on this side so that I don't have adhesive sticking to this other flap over here. Okay, and then we'll stamp the I appreciate you on this side instead because then when you open it, we'll be able to see I appreciate you. And then of course we need to add some embellishments. Grab some of these really cute iridescent pearls that come in this suite, this collection, just like that. So fun. All right, let me show you some other cards that I've made using this same simple layout. Here's another one. Again, this is using that Thoughtful Wishes designer series paper. So cute. Here's one using the Simply Zinnia. It's a really fun layout. And Hello Spring. So fun. This is a really striking and simple layout that you can use with any collection of products, especially those that have really cute designer series paper with it. If you have any questions, make sure to comment below and make sure to go follow us on social media at Stamping Jill. And make sure to give our YouTube channel a follow if you wanna see more videos like this. Thanks so much. We'll see you next time for a Watch It Weekly Wednesday.